What is origami? Japanese art, paper folding, decorative shapes. It's ancient, restrictive, and linear. Then engineers came. They see mathematical principles, geometrical laws, and unlimited possibilities. Origami becomes an engineering tool to transform 2D into 3D and opens a new door to brilliant innovations. Origami's mathematical rules translate to unique properties, and in civil engineering, these properties have been exploited to design deployable structures. At Georgia Tech, Professor Glossio Paulino and his research group investigate how structural engineering can be used to translate origami concepts into designs that will provide more stable, flexible, and environmentally friendly structures. I got interested in origami because of uh, its natural connection with uh, engineering, especially structural engineering. This is the standard uh, Miura pattern. And uh, depending on the application, we can have several variations. For example, here you can see an uh, origami bridge that uh, is deployable. And uh, we can use uh, this kind of uh, machine to print uh, the Miura pattern or any other type of origami pattern that we can uh, pre-program in the machine and then we can fold it. The same techniques used to fold paper cranes and cootie catchers can now be used to lift buildings support tunnels, and assemble bridges. And beyond civil engineering, origami pushes the limits even above the Earth's surface. You may have seen the latest uh, State of the Union from uh, President Barack Obama, where uh, he indicated that uh, he wants us to explore space, not just to visit, but that we stay. In order to do that, uh, we need to deploy into space structures that are lighter, stronger, tougher, and safer. And that's where origami can play a major role. Origami inspires innovation in many fields of engineering, from large deployable solar panels to microscopic heart stents. And now, as strange as it sounds, a simple piece of paper and a lot of creativity are helping to build a better and brighter future for human society.